It's the annual Irving ISD High School Art Show. Selections of artwork from all over the district are being showcased at Irving Art Center. You're going to have a combination of, we have paintings and drawings, we have um, 3D work, um, fibers, we have sculpture, ceramics, jewelry even. After working hard all year, students are displaying some of their best work for the community. It's like a recital for them, so it's a time to, for them to be able to uh, get accolades from the public and see their work and compare it to others. The general theme of the sculpture in itself is the facial expression of what? Its name is Nani and that's Japanese for what and you could imply the meaning. This is freelance, it's more random, it's mixed emotions, but whenever you look at it, it's supposed to bring out your own emotions. The process of creating an original work of art can be rewarding and therapeutic. It calms me down. It's a way for me to get lost uh, and, and kind of tune everything else out around me. When I touch the paper, my hand just like flows out. You know, my hand makes different objects and those objects become materials that I think in my head. And then to me, I just bring it all to life and it just appeals to me in a way that I think is unique and different. While parents and the community are proud of these students' accomplishments, the event is particularly meaningful to their teachers. I enjoy uh, seeing the students' faces, the smiles on their faces when they walk in and see their work up, and I enjoy talking to the parents too. Events like this are just great for our students. It gives them a, a chance to shine. Um, it gives them um, a platform. Some students, this is their niche, and I just think it's, it's a great way to celebrate. Congratulations to all the Irving ISD students for another colorful and unique exhibit. For About Town, this is Susan Kamyon.